Welcome to How to Repair Your Own Legend Now. We appreciate your coming here and getting information from us. And we've just got a little bit of some bookkeeping kinds of things here to go over with you as we start. We're going to cover the four areas of this that, that we feel are really important. We call that assess, correct, make over, and monitor. So we're going to cover those things. We would like you there on the webinar, you can type in questions to us. You can see that right there on your screen right now. Uh, we can't get to all these questions right here. We know that. I'll be monitoring over here as Dr. Mark is doing some other things over there. I'll be monitoring where these questions are and I'll jot down some of these questions and we'll answer some in those four areas. And every time we finish an area, we'll answer a couple questions, maybe one or two questions and then right. we'll move on. But rest assured, I mean, Feel free to put in uh, your questions now because we will yes. answer all of your questions. It's just that the ones we can't get to during the webinar itself, we're going to send you back by email. Right, we'll email you. And if you send us a really awesome question, we may actually create a whole podcast about it uh, separately afterwards because we love to answer questions. If you are state licensed, Right. We want people to go and look at those sites, That's not right. just the Google results. Remember, the, your license is a piece of public information. Right. And for example, here we're in Pennsylvania, it's the Bureau of Professional and Occupational Affairs. They every month post uh, you know, information about anyone who has had any kind of license violation, whether it's something as minor as they, they didn't get enough uh, continuing education credits that year, all the way up to people who have been uh, charged with a felony and had their license revoked and things like that. That's all out there on the web now, uh, and it, it can leak out from those sites. I mean, you know, someone who's doing a little bit of background research can decide to post a blog and write up about, you know, did you hear about Dr. Samuels? I mean, we use a, a Dr. Samuels example. We do. Um, you know, so you gotta you gotta go look not only at Google, but you have to now go look at these things because especially if you're a professional who's licensed. People are being encouraged to go and check out your license history right on that site. So you want to find out what's there so that you're not getting an ugly surprise one day. And some of these things start out pretty innocently. We have a buddy named Jerry. I won't say anything further about Jerry, but Jerry, just on his Facebook profile the other day, writes about a bookstore that he went into, and it was at the closing time, and he asked somebody in the store a question, and the guy said, I'm sorry, sir, we're closing and didn't answer the question and so Jerry gets ticked off and he writes in Facebook that oh what a great way to run this store well those kinds of things start to add up well you know you you just reminded me of a conference we went to uh, you know in Ocean City Maryland yes. and there was an example where there was a presenter a very high high power kind of guy and he was a little ticked off at the uh, the taxi service that was supposed to drive him he was late uh, arriving for his presentation and so he got up on stage, he pulled out his flip camera, and he recorded a negative ad. Diatribe? Say, a diatribe about this taxi service. And uh, I don't know if he followed through on his thread or not, but he said he was going to put that on his blog and uh, you know, voice uh, his opinion that no one in their right mind should uh, call for this uh, taxi service or limit. So yeah. this is what's happening on the internet. It's now so easy. Uh, we like some of these easy tools because they're great when we get into the you know kind of makeover and, re and create your own legend side uh, it's about how you're going to take control of your online identity but everyone has access to the same the same tools so it takes one angry client one angry family member of a client or a customer uh, who has an active one blog. former spouse uh, well that's been known to happen too yes Hi, this is Charlie Seymour Jr. And this is Dr. Mark Costner. And when you search your name online, what do you find? That's right. You, we always recommend that you go to Google, go to the search engine, search yourself, your keywords, do an assessment, look at what you find. Is that an accurate reflection of who you are and how you want to appear to people when they look for you? That's right, because we have Create Your Own Legend now, and we're helping people really build up that legend about themselves online so that when people search for them, they really see the side of them that they want. And it's three to ten pages deep of information about you that you control. But Charlie, but what happens when you do that assessment? 
you're in those first three pages and you find either it's not a good reflection of you or someone has posted negative reviews about you or negative information about you or inaccurate information, what are right. you supposed to do? People exactly. keep asking us that. People keep coming to us about that. So we're going to cover that in this webinar. I'm really thrilled with the outline that we've come up with for this webinar. So on Tuesday, we want you to join us on this webinar. See what it is to create that legend about yourself. Grow that personal side of you that other people can see. But when there's a problem, you need to be able to take care of that. And that's what we're going to be able to help you with on this webinar. That's right. So just click the link here. Go to the registration page. We're going to give you our four-part system for how you're going to repair going to your it own to you. legend. And you can choose on the registration form what time on Tuesday is going to work best for you. We're going to do this a couple of times on Tuesday. Right. So click that link. Go sign up for this webinar and learn how to create your own legend. And if there's a problem, how to repair your own legend now. Join us on the webinar.